second set, serve for a place in the final. It was Courier's first win over a top 10 player since last year's French Open. Victory over Chang in Japan, reinforcing the view that he's back big time. And one friendly face in the crowd couldn't believe his luck. In the final, Courier the champion here in 92, already a winner at Adelaide and Scottsdale, bidding for his third title of 95. Up against him, the only man with a better record this year, Agassi, nursing a suspect back, but going for his fourth title of 95. It was Courier who was first out of the blocks, and once again, his reactions were nothing short of phenomenal. Courier had won his last five matches against Agassi and was keen to ram the point home early on. <laughs> Courier was giving Agassi precious little to bite on. So when the Las Vegas saw a tasty morsel, he gorged on it. <laughs> Courier's traveling coach, Craig Boynton, looked more relaxed once his man had taken the first set. But Courier knew he couldn't afford to switch off. Game in. Courier got an early break in the second set, but although Agassiz's intensity grew, the big man was mixing guile with brute force, and the cocktail was too fierce. It had been a stunning exhibition from Courier, and at 5-4, he served for the title. Courier may not look as invincible as he did three years ago, but Tokyo has shown that once more, he's going to be a considerable presence in any tournament.